Welcome back. Minister of Information Technology Tariq Kamen officially opened a new multinational service centre at Cairo Smart Village. The reflect these, this reflects rather Egypt's success in attracting foreign investment to the sector, a result of shrewd strategy making. Amira Rossum reports. The triumph of the Egyptian IT industry. At a ceremony in Cairo's Smart Village, Minister of Information Technology Tariq Kemil opened a new service center for one of the world's top multinational companies. The presence of such big business has definite advantages for the development of the sector and encourages local companies to learn from their success. Just a couple of weeks ago, AT Kearney has announced their, uh, uh, their study about emerging countries in offshoring and outsourcing. Egypt has jumped from number 13 in 2007 to uh, number uh, five or six uh, in 2009. This is definitely not without reason. This is because of the investments of infrastructure as well as other types of incentive packages that we have been preparing. Egypt has proven to be an attractive choice for international investors for a variety of reasons. Most importantly, the country's political stability and cheap labor costs. Most importantly, the vision of the government, the way that they understand the role that information technology plays in transforming a country for the better. Uh, the availability of the focus specifically on contact centers as a major opportunity area. The availability of talented, enthusiastic labor, uh, labor pool that we can continue to rely on for the long term. But the government doesn't plan to stop here. The ministry has been devising a dynamic strategy to attract investors to the IT sector. We have a plan that we are implementing and a strategy that we have implementing on putting uh, uh, and positioning Egypt really as the uh, hub in the Middle East for offshoring and, out, uh, and outsourcing. And we see this within a win-to-win -win relationship to our partners uh, uh, including the multinationals. We invite them uh, to make a benefit out of the growing market in the ICT sector in Egypt and the region. At the end of the day, Egypt is the gateway to the regional market by the talents and by the geographic allocation, as well as by uh, several other preferential advantages that the Egyptian market. This type of strategy requires cooperation and dedication from all sides. But the energy which the ministry is investing in this plan does seem to be netting results. Investment in Egyptian industry seems to be on the up and up. And with help from multinational companies, it can only lead to a bright future for this exceedingly proactive industry. Amira Mohsen, reporting for Nile TV International.